focus. There. Okay, folks, the Gleek and Dan Show has now become the Gleek and Dan Detective Show because of dun 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 this. Uh, Gleek? Yeah? What is this? It's called a skittily. Oh, you heard it here first. This is a skittily. Hey, Gleek? Yeah? What's a skittily? It's a secret device used by the Spartans around 400 B.C. And it looks like our messenger stuck it in your gym sack. So he stuck it in... Whoa. Hold on. They stuck it in my gym sack? Yeah. I went in there to look for a sock for the sock puppet show. Ew. You were going to use Dano's gym sock? It was a clean pair. Some unknown person placed their hands in my very own gym sock. Daniel's going to need some serious therapy after this. They've crossed the line. They've defiled my gym sack. Actually, the skiddly was a wooden rod that was skinnier on one end than the other. Tapered. I feel violated. But Gleek was going to use your sock for the puppet show. With my permission, this person, if you could call him or that, didn't even ask. They just thrust their dirty paw into my sacred sock. When a military commander wanted to send a secret message, he would wrap a piece of parchment or leather like this around the skittily and write a message on it. The guy getting the message would have a skittily with the same dimensions. When he wrapped the message around the skittily, the message would appear. Hey, what's that? It fell out of the cloth. Gleek, you're on deck. You're on deck? Like, softball? Of course! Of course? You're doing it again. Doing what again? Never mind. This is just like a skittily. If whoever sent this used a baseball bat like this, it should all line up to read. Birth mark right ear. Well, that doesn't make any sense. I don't have a birthmark on my right ear. I wonder who does. What does it mean? Hey, Gleek, turn around. What? Just do it. Take off your glasses. Okay, let's try moving your hair back. Bingo. What? There's a birthmark behind your right ear. How would they know that? And who is they? Somebody out there is watching us. Maybe... Maybe right... No. Okay, it's 8.37. Where is he? Maybe they kidnapped him or something. Don't say that. Just joking around. Well, don't joke about this stuff. I'm scared, and you should really be scared. What are you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. Oh, the websites? Ms. Benson told me those religious people use mind control to suck you in. That's why their stuff is illegal. Daniel, don't mess with them. I'm telling you, they're evil. There's definitely something evil out there, but I don't think it's them. I think it's the government. Why can't you just be normal? You mean just like you? Yeah, just like me, just like the rest of the world. A great poet once said, don't be conformed by the world, but be transformed by the renewing of your mind. Who said that? I forgot, like Shakespeare or something? Well, that quote itself is dangerous. That's what's different about me and you. You always go with what the world said you should do. And what's so wrong about doing that? If you're just going to be like everyone else, then why are you needed? That's cruel. Aubrey, I'm not trying to be cruel. R remember what you said the other day? Why do I exist? So you think I'm the first part of that saying and you're the last part? Yeah. Be transformed by the renewing of your mind. This stuff I'm reading online, I'm starting to think and whole new way and it's changing me. That's exactly what I'm talking about. That stuff is scary. What they're teaching us at school is scary. I can't believe you just said that. Aubrey, do you ever get the feeling that, I don't know, something's missing? There's got to be more to life than what we're being told. Well, yeah, sure. It's kind of what I was doing with the other day. Now it's my turn. I'm going to tell you something I've never told anyone else before. Okay. I've been having trouble sleeping at night. I just wake up in the dark. There's just a, this one thought that always comes up. 
something's wrong. There's this just hole in my heart. And I'm trying to just look up at the ceiling and try to fall back asleep. But I can't. Oh, Daniel. But these websites, they're helping. They're, they're, they're helping me see things I've, I've never seen before. Just, Daniel, just be careful. Gleek? What happened to you? I've been doing what I call creative researching. What, like hacking? Well, I've always kind of suspected something, so I got curious. I checked into some files at school. I don't know, Gleek. Take a look. Daniel, you think yeah, the officer was with us, right? That, that's our classroom. That, that was just yesterday. They've been monitoring everything we say, everything we do. So? Now watch what happens when Daniel starts talking about reading things by religious extremists. I've been reading some stuff from those religious extremists. Daniel, you're not supposed to be looking at that stuff. You could get arrested. I think we should stop talking about this now. Yeah. Whoa. I told you that was dangerous. But what's the real danger here? Is it those religious extremist guys? Or is it the people who have been watching our every move? Or they could be the same people. They could be watching us right now. Yeah, you're right. We should go. Bye.